Okay, so we will be talking now about the new Miss Universe Miss Philippines. Philippines. Yeah. Okay, Pia, um, the characteristics of a Miss Universe winner has been evolving ever since you were crowned. So, what do you think should we look for in the next Miss Universe Philippines in order to cope with the changes? Okay, um, the girl has to have a solid advocacy, not a made-up one because of competition. Because the audience, they're smarter now. They can do their research. They can go through your social media to see if sinimulan mo lang ba ngayon because you joined. You need to have a solid advocacy. And if you're planning to join a pageant like Miss Universe Philippines or Binibini Pilipinas, simulan mo na yung advocacy mo kahit di ka pa sasali. Kahit next year ka pa balak sumali, simulan mo na ngayon. Adv a solid advocacy, very important. And being able to articulate, uh, to 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 convey your, your thoughts and your emotions like uh, properly by the way you speak. Again, your accent doesn't have to be perfect or your grammar, but just get your points across. Kailangan may personality kasi alam na rin ng mga tao ngayon. People know when you're a pageant party and when you're rehearsed. Mm. And so it's, um, it's harder to join pageants now. The standards are really high. But those are the things that I think um, have changed now. And like the things that every girl has to prepare for. Yung personality, Q&A, advocacy. Yung tatlo na yun. Because styling, your weight, the way you look, pwedeng babu baguhin yun eh. Diba? That's true. That's true, yeah. How yung core mo, yung uh, ano mo, mo, principles mo, advocacy mo, opinion mo. Mga panin, beliefs mo, solid dapat yan. So, it should be, ano, dapat buo na yan bago ka pa sumali. Okay. Yung mga, ako, sorry. Yes, Drew. Uh, curious lang ako, sino sa tingin mo yung mga strong contenders sa MUP this year? Okay. Yeah. Medyo on, vocal ka naman sa social media. <laughs> yeah, based on the, what I've seen, I mean, ako ha, naniniwala ako sa mga dark horse, Yes, that's true. true. That's true. Yeah. I really believe in them, but right now, matunog si Alisa, of course. Um, si Michelle Gumabaw, si Sandra Lemonon, si Miss Sorsogon, si Maria Isabella. Anong pangalan? Galeria. Galeria. Oh. Ah, Galeria. So malakas din siya. Meron pa ba? May miss out pa ba? Meron pa eh. Di pa? No, nakalimutan ko sila. Pero <laughs> nabanggit mo naman lahat ng ano, lahat ng kontra na halo. Baka yung mga course. ano, hindi ko nabanggit, lumapit sa akin sabihin na, Hey, Ay. I watched your interview at Missisology and you didn't mention my name. My name. <laughs> 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 Ang lakas naman ng loob niya kung lapit siya sa'yo na. <laughs> well, you know, bro, did you expect Ariela Arida to win Miss Universe Philippines? She was in my top five. Nasa top uh, three ko siya actually. Hindi na niwala sa akin sa ano yung mga tao about Ara during that time. Kasi <laughs> ang, ang favorite ang favorite ng 2013 si Mutya, di ba? Mutya talaga. No, no, no. Um, that's true. I remember. Ang cute ni Mutya. Pia, ano? Uh, may posibilidad ba na mag-judge ka this year for Miss Universe Philippines? Um, well, I turned it... Well, I, they didn't ask me formally pero parang casually na pag-usapan lang alam mo yun para eh kung gusto eh kung judge papayag ka ba sabi ko no um cuz it's the first year and i don't want it to seem like kasi si Shamsi tapos si Le, Le, uh, Le Andrea Le, oh ano eh ayoko na mag mag magmukhang biased yung pageant sa aces Ayoko. Ayoko nang may ganun. So, at saka, I also learned like a lesson from judging Miss Universe. Um, I judged Miss Universe too soon. Mm -hmm. Miss Universe asked me to become a judge. I was hesitant. I asked some advice from friends. Tapos sabi nila, sayang, gawin mo, ganun. Pero yung mm -hmm. feeling ko talaga is no. Kasi masyado pang maaga, kakapanalo ko pa lang. Baka sabihin naman, bias ako. Baka pag hindi nanalo si Rachel, isisi sa akin. Pagka nanalo, uh, 
sa akin pa rin isisisi. So, ano? So, I learned a lesson from there, from that time. Sabi ko, I'll wait a few more years. Siguro pagka medyo older na ako, tsaka na ako mag-judge ng Binibini or Miss PH. Pero ngayon, as long as I'm still involved in, like, not involved, still kind of in the pageant world, I don't want to be... Ayoko naisipin ng mga tao na biased ako eh. Kasi fair mm-hmm. naman sila mag-score. Pero na-hurt kasi ako nung nabash ko kay Rachel. So, ayoko. 